So this is 2018 Unit 5 Physics Question 1. Uh, the questions are attached below, or you can pause the video and give the questions and go off the screen. But I'm about to go through the answers. So in this first one, we've got a car suspension system. The cord spring supports some of the weight of the car, and it's tested by placing under stress, which is the correct unit for stress. So stress is the force downwards on a set area. So the bigger the area, the less stress. Smaller the area, more stress. So it's force divided by area. So we'll need meters squared. So it's either going to be C or D, and it's newtons per meter squared, which can be written as n to the minus two or n divided by meters squared. So the correct answer to this one is D. Now we've got a calculation next up. You may not be familiar with this calculation, but they give you absolutely everything you need to answer it. So they tell you that strain equals delta x. So you've got to work out what delta x is and L. We can see the cold spring has an original length of 0.4 meters. So I'm going to go with that as my L. So L equals 0.4. And when tested, the length of the spring changes by 0.08. Now we've got a change here. And that's what this delta symbol means. So it's changed. So we're going to have strain equal to 0.08 divided by 0.4, which gives us a strain of 0.02. So one mark for the answer, one for showing you working out there. Then we've got a force extension graph, and it asked uh, an extra figure to show the elastic limit. So that's the point where it's no longer proportional. So the moment it starts to curve, so we've got straight, and then it starts to curve, and it's that point where it switches between the two. So an X there. And our final part of this question, the cord spring breaks because of mechanical fatigue. Which statement correctly describes the cause of mechanical fatigue? Is it repeated loading and unloading, slow permanent deformation, sudden cracking, or sudden adding of a large load? Well, I'm going to run out these sudden cracking and sudden adding of a large load. I'm going to cross them out because they sound instantaneous. Well, fatigue is over a long time. Slow permanent deformation is just kind of losing its stress, uh, giving it to the stress. So B kind of fits all right, but actually on this one, fatigue is constant use. You get tired from constant use and it will be repeated loading and unloading, so A.